Our first lesson this semester in Revit will be how to scale an image to be used as a reference for your drawings. A lot of times you'll find that you're given a PDF or existing plans that are not digitally represented that you can upload into your document. So being able to scale an image into your drafting will speed up the process and help you more accurately have the dimensions that you need and window locations and things like that. So you can find the, the same image that I'm going to be using here in the Canvas module in the lab prep. So you can, you can download that image and then once you open Revit, you'll go to Insert Image, locate that floor plan, put it in and click. And here you have dimensions shown of what these should be. So I'm going to measure this exterior to the exterior and see what it is. And mine's saying it's just over 70 feet when it should be 24 feet, 11 inches. So I will escape out of that and then I'll select my image. Now, in order to scale something, you're gonna have to use the scale tool. Um, it was used to be referred to as resize. So you'll select your image and then you'll go up here under modify and you'll see this scale selection right here. One thing to note, whenever you are looking at any tools along this, this bar here, um, if you hover over it, it'll tell you what it does, but then it has those two letters that are in the parentheses after the name. That is your quick key. So if you're looking for a quick key, um, how to scale, that would be RE. So instead of clicking that, you could simply type in the letters RE and it would activate the scale tool. So I'm just gonna click this because I'm here. And the first thing Revit tells you to do is to click to enter the origin. Um, so for me, the easiest thing is to zoom in so that I know I am selecting the exact right spot on the line. So I click here. And then the next spot I wanna select is over here at the end of this dimension line. I'm gonna get as close to it as I can and then zoom out without clicking again. Here you'll see that as I move my mouse back and forth, Revit is trying to scale up or scale down my drawing. Because I have nothing else drawn here as a snapping point, the best way and most accurate way to resize this to the dimension that I need is to just input the dimension. So I'm gonna put in 24 feet, 11 inches and hit enter. There, my image has been scaled. So now I can take my wall tool and then I can draw my walls according to the dimensions here. I don't have to have all of the dimensions. For example, um, I don't have the exact dimensions here from this wall to this wall. I have an approximation that was given on this plan, but this gives you a better idea of where things are located. 